Welcome aboard, Cosmonauts. My name is Cosmic Oceans. I'm back with Night in the Woods. Uh, last we left off, we got really fucking drunk at a party. Um, but I also kind of want to try Demon Tower again. Because I don't know how much of this we get to play. And I want to know if we get like a reward for um, finishing it. I don't need those lives yet. Emphasis on the yet. Let's test my theory about... Oh, you can. I guess it'd be inadvisable, though. Okay, let's get the... Okay, P, grab. Let's try to just get the heck out of here. Okay, we got full lives. Get wrecked. What the heck is this? wasn't here last time. Okay, I'm slightly terrified of what's behind here. One hit is two lives, dude. Dang it. I can't run away, can I? This is the worst, honestly. Oh my god. This is gonna be really difficult to do. We got dead. Man, I hate that we have to do the whole thing over. Yeah, we're gonna surrender to the horror. Goodness me. Alright, well, let's go outside and pretend to be a normal functioning member of society. <sighs> Whoa, no! We can look in the mirror. Oh good. I was right. I look like utter hell. Burn it. <laughs> Afternoon us. Okay. God, this thing is intense. Weird how big clocks are like luxury furniture now, since everything has a clock and internet on it. Like having something big that only does one thing is like a statement or something. <laughs> Wonder how old this thing is. Uh, I don't know. Sup, bird? May? Yeah? Come say hi. Okay. Hey, hun. 
sudden you look like crap. Thanks. Rough night. I was just tired. Is it that obvious? No, I was just saying you look like crap because I love you. Thanks. <laughs> if you want to talk about it, it's cool, Mom. Already in the woods. From senior year? Yeah, he was home from school for the weekend. Did you talk to him? Uh, kind of, sort of, I don't know. Well, he's a jerk, hun. No, he's not, or he wasn't. I don't know. Anyway, looks like most of the repair workers have cleared out of townies, uh, town center. Finally. Yeah, they're all done with the church hill steps and the power lines. Great. Hun, do not want you... <laughs> I do not want you up on those things. Mom, I'm 20. Uh-huh, which means you go to jail for it. No one is going to jail for running around on the power lines. Psh, they'd never catch me. Your Aunt Molly catches you up there. There's no telling what she'll do. Did I tell you I saw her yesterday out front? Really? Yeah, she was being all weird and cryptic. I don't know, everything's fuzzy today. And anyway, it's dangerous. You remember Susie Kushner? Gee, Mom, I sure don't. I've definitely never heard this story a thousand times. Fried, honey. The paper used the word fried. Now she can't use adjectives. She lost an entire part of speech. Gee, Mom, that's terrible. See, that's exactly... That's the exact kind of sentence Susie can't formulate. So what are you up to today? I don't know, gonna go see what Greg and Boo are up to. Boo? Boo? I don't know. You all gonna do something together? I don't know, I don't think they hang out much. Past uh, messing around with our old band equipment. Well, there are only so many hours and so many days in our lives. There's going to be, is there going to be some bug going around that makes people talk like fortune cookies? Friendships are like trees. Uh-huh. You have to water them so they grow. <laughs> and we each have only so much water. Have you ever watered a tree? No, God does that. Okay, I'm out. See you later, sweetie. What you reading? Book about a guy who grew up secretly living on a fishing ship. Living in a barrel, eating raw fish, crabs, octopus, squid, lobster, gulls, albatross. I get it. Wow. Sharks, dolphins, sea cucumbers, seaweed, sand, rocks, kelp, but that's the same as seaweed, I think. You get the picture. Yeah. The crew thought the boat was haunted, but nope, just the Barrel Boy. What's the book called? Barrel Boy. Oddly enough, I now want fish sticks. I know, right? I'll have your father bring some home. Have a nice day, sweetie. Have a nice day, sweetie. No, mom! And still more of your wisdom. Are they... They're still here. Yeah, all that about not walking on power lines, uh, I don't think I got any of that. What's up? Hey, May. Hey, Salmers. Did I see you with the, uh, a journal the other day? Oh yeah, doctor's orders. Yeah, Dr. Hank has me doing one too. Oh, okay. Did you have anger problems too? I was stealing painkillers from the Ham Panther Pharmacy. Oh geez. So Dr. Hank sees journals as a general cure-all. Is it working for you? Nope. Reham and the program do, though. And I've become a very good poet. Wanna hear one? Yeah. My heart is a dark darkness, but when I see you, I feel a thankness. Oh, that's really nice. When I feel a blueness, all I need is a you-ness. That's very romantic. It's about my horse. Oh, we're just friends. Mr. Chekhovsky's up on the roof again. I'm pretty sure he's gonna break his damn neck. He falls through one of the windows. I will not hesitate to take legal action. Who? Him up there on the roof next door. 
If he falls down from that w from that roof through a window, you're going to have to pick which part of him you're going to sue. Whichever piece is biggest. <laughs> I can hear you, you know. Don't remember inviting you up here. Sorry. This is awfully familiar of you. Uh, I guess it is. Can we not get up here? Ah! We fell. Hold on, I want to see if I can get up there. And talk to Telescope Man. Not sure I can. But maybe. We're gonna try, anyway. Since we're here. could have knocked on the door down there. Impolite being on other people's roofs. Next time I'm gonna call the cops. Whatever. <laughs> At any rate, I'm glad you have accepted my invitation. What are you doing anyway? Hunting dusk stars. What's dusk stars? My shoegaze band. What's dusk stars? Wandering stars, the light of which does not come through at night. How does that work? trick of the atmosphere and setting sunlight only visible for a few weeks every year in the spring and fall so lovely neato wanna have a look yes excellent holy crap my eyes well you want to put a filter on like so jeez sun is bright my <laughs> make you blind you didn't think to mention this I just did Is that a dusk star? What am I looking for here? Hmm. It's very pretty, but am I looking for something? out. Well, I guess we'll try again. What is this? Hmm. I feel like it has something to do with these weird little things, but I'm not sure. Am I supposed to be- ooh! Oh! tells the story of a woman who built a tower to heaven, and for this the god sunk her deep into the sea. Wow, that's screwed up. But even in the depths she refused to die. Damn straight. Oh, will you never die as well? I guess someday. <laughs> never. 
Defy Cassius' god also, will you? The gods in these stories are only stand-ins for things we cannot control. You might say floods or the cancer or such. Not all of them. No to all of them. This is fair. I guess we're looking for more of them? If there are more to find? Or is there only one? Or do we have to find them like every day or whatever? Hmm, I can't figure this out. What? No, I don't wanna... Try again. I thought we already found it. Do we have to find more? Supposed to be this one this time? Okay, found one. Let me have a look. Ah, oh, yes, Dorth the murderer. Okay, I'm interested. Dorth passed, uh, Behind the King's procession on the street. Dor was quiet and said nothing, and the King took offense to this. Why? Why? Royalty is strange. So what happened? Be here and insulted Dor's, Dor's family and Dor's village and so on until he was down to the insulting Dor's chickens. Damn. <laughs> Dor first murdered Behrin's chickens. Then his ancestral village. Then his family. Holy crap. Then when he came to Behrin, the king was silent. I'm going to get a tattoo of this guy. Is Zor a hero? Totally. I don't know. But it doesn't really matter, I think. Like, if you've been told you're nothing before, a story like this sounds pretty okay. Well, it is a true story and real people died. And you should feel terrible. Seriously? Bleh heh heh. I believe we have seen both stars visible today. Oh, really? They come and go so fast. Okay. Well, I guess that was pretty great. We can look again in two days' time. Will you be back? Yeah, if I remember. Oh, you will be. No one can resist the stars forever. That's spooky, Mr. Chaz Fuck. That's so funny. Okay. Okay, let's go. We gotta go see our friends, and they're all working like decent people. Who have things to do with their lives. I wanna go see, uh, Bo. What? Where exactly are you planning on going? I don't know, Ham Panther. But honey, you're only gonna get minimum there. And I hear they're murder. This place is murder. I don't know, think I can handle one more income call. I wake up sometimes because I hear that bing noise. Nowadays, I just take a sleep aid works wonders. We shouldn't have to drug ourselves to get our sleep back from this job. Well, Ham Panther isn't gonna give you a bonus. Ham Panther doesn't even have a leaderboard. But it isn't calls, it is from sales. I wouldn't be waiting for that bing. I don't know, honey. Maybe you'll have a good shift today and get on the leaderboard, and we'll see how you feel then. I guess, but it won't change anything. Coffee, cigarettes, coffee, cigarettes. Okay. General unrest among the townsfolk. <laughs> Uh, let me talk to this guy first. How's it going, dude? Got a job here, that's cool. Oh, nice. Actually, I'm lying, it sucks. Oh, jeez. I had no idea there were so many kinds of hammers, and wrenches, and nails. My god, the nails. 
Hey, boo. Yo, yo, yo. Sorry about last night. I get woozy on cold medicine. So I don't know what I expected to happen. Sorry for what I said. You know, I don't really remember it much. So what else? Hooray for alcohol. Newtown motto. Band practice later? Haha, <laughs> yep. I'm amazed it's still a thing. We were barely even a band in high school. Yeah, it's fun to get to hang out with Angus. How did you even end up doing it? When Cassie left town, Angus told me that Greg was really sad, so I volunteered to be the new drummer. Well, drummer. It's a laptop, boo. It sure is, May. It sure is. I'll see you later. I got some work to do. Okay. I'm just here trying to water our friendship tree. Wait a second. Hold, hold on. No, can't get up there. I thought maybe I could climb up on the shelves, but I guess not. Boop, boop, boop. Aw, pregnant raccoon. Let's talk to Angus. Hey, May. Hey, Angus, how's it going? You're like the third person I've seen today. I know you've explained it, but I have zero clue how this place stays open. You'd be surprised. Band practice later? Gotta warm up my voice. You growl real good. Thanks, I'm born. <laughs> I'm a born growler. When I was a baby, I never cried. I just growled. I think I cried non-stop until I was like nine. And then I cried all the time again, starting at like 13. You had a good three years of not crying in there. <laughs> they were really productive years. Hee <laughs> hee. That's so, uh, <laughs> accurate. <laughs> what the? What? No. No, 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 no. Possibilities is gone. No more pizza delivery, no more big sound, no more birth, no more special birthdays. This is the worst thing that's happened to this town since the flood that took out the petting zoo. The mini golf ice cream place. Oh, that would be amazing. <laughs> Summer nights, eating ice cream, playing some putt-putt, all washed away. I'm so freaking depressed now. That sucks. This sucks. Oh, hey, hey, Jeremy Want? No one calls me that. Germ, right? Germ Warfare. Oh, that's stuck, huh? Yep. That's an okay name. Your name is May. Yep. That's an okay name. Okay. You were like a year behind me, right? Two years. So you're fresh out, huh? I hang out with Greg sometimes. We ride bikes. I'm pretty good at it. Okay. What? I saw a rabid possum the other day. Really? Where? It was crawling across the road. Had it been hit by a car? Nah, just rabid. What happened to it? Got hit by a car. Wow. It was like a poem. Okay. You weirdo. <laughs> Greg! Well, look who it is. Yep, alive for another day. How are you feeling? Feeling pretty bad, but I've been across town, and I don't know, that helped. Fresh air, or as it fresh as it gets around here. Delicious. So what's up? I was just stopping in, gonna roll out. We're gonna head out to band practice? Okay. I'm scared. <laughs> All right, kids, I gotta head out soon. Where are you going? Family stuff. Oh, okay. Just for a night. Okay, are we doing this? Yeah, let's do this. Wait, I don't know the song. Like, at all. And I barely remember how to play bass. You'll be fine. I completely will not be fine. Zero <laughs> self-confidence. No, I just don't know the song. You stupid jerks. Okay. 
wasn't as bad as the first time I played. Oh man, that was uh, pretty bad is what it was. I literally do not know this song. Weird Autumn, inexcusable. <laughs> oh, come on, it wasn't that bad. Germ? F the cops! Ta-da! And Selmer's a poet. Uh, great. Hey, hey, duder. Angus leaving for the night? Yeah, gonna be bored. Or rather, I would be if I didn't have plans. Plans? Crimes. Oh, crimes. You up for some crimes? Ahem. <clears throat> cool, let me know. Good practice. Was it? Eh. Cool, great. You want to do something tonight? Um, I promise I'll be in it. It'll be an improvement on our last night. What are you thinking of doing? Uh, hmm. Want to go to the mall? The mall? Yeah. Fort Lucin, like we did when we were kids. When's the last time you were at Fort Lucin Mall? I don't know, five years ago? Yeah, uh, what? You know what? Yeah, let's go. Great. Yep, great. I promise it'll be great. Okay. We sure we're doing this? Let me check with Gray. Yeah, let's go mauling. Great. We need to rekindle our friendship. Glad I didn't puke in here. Me too. Maybe I just never drink again. Or maybe you just take it easy next time. I don't know if I do moderation well. I could see that. I think the term is risk-taking behavior. <laughs> Are you seeing someone about this? Hanging with you is working pretty well tonight. No pressure. Uh, should be getting paid by the hour. I got gum. I'm gonna turn on the radio now. Okay. Old gods of the Fort Lucid Mall. I don't know what's going on. For Lucene! Oh my god. Yep. What the hell happened? Um, the internet? Well, the internet... We had the internet when we used to come here. What happened to the carousel? Sold it, I guess. Who buys a carousel? Nobody who comes here. What happened to the bookstore? Also the internet. What happened to the arcade? I'm going to make a sign that says the internet and hold it up until you're done asking. 
Well, this kind of sucks. <laughs> Can we... Okay. We have to use WASD. What happened to internet? And yet Dollar Empire is still here? I think this is the one thing the internet can't compete with, I guess. I used to do that. As a kid. You get an eraser for a dollar and a pencil for a dollar. That actually doesn't sound like a good deal. Oh god, you're right. Oh my god. The unrev is still here. Haha, <laughs> yeah, this old thing. I can feel the edginess from here. Just looking at- just looking in there makes me feel old. We are so gonna do this. There's no way I'm going in there. You're totally coming in here with me. Oh, for God's sake. Holy crap. I'm 14 again. Yep, pretty nuts in here. Hey, isn't that... Shut up. Haha, <laughs> nice. Dead Party Boy stickers in 2017. I think they're back in. Hmm, that's cool. Bet you listen to them. Um, yeah, they're good. Yeah, if you're 30 years old and sad, <laughs> I'm getting there. That's funny. Hmm. Oh, I haven't seen belt buckles in a while. At least not fashionable ones. Mike at the shop has one with a uh, rattlesnake driving a semi truck. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Do what? Cover me, I'm gonna grab one. What? No. Shh. You're not doing this. Oh my god, we are not. So you're really gonna do this. Shh, be cool. No big thing. Shoplifting. Vandalism. Piracy. Shoplifting again now. Anyway, I just did the easy crimes. How is this stupid idea easy? Our eyes evolved to notice movement like dinosaurs. If the dinosaur is moving... Wait, that's not... Never mind. So long as you're perfectly still when the clerk is watching. Like you're gonna freeze when she looks over, even if you're in the middle of putting it in your pocket. And this is gonna work because dinosaurs, just like dinosaurs. I'm gonna pretend to not know you until you're done, okay? Oh my god, I cannot believe. Sweet. I can't. What are you doing? Oh yeah. Shut up and let's get out of here. So stupid, May. <laughs> oh, sweet belt buckle, I am never ever going to wear. Rubbed against my stomach. This is bad, May. You should steal something now. Pardon? Haven't you ever done, like, any crimes? I mean, yeah, I guess, hasn't everyone? Well, get back in there, champ. What? No. Beatrice, let me lay this out. One, the security cameras aren't even on in there. Two, the cashier clearly isn't paying attention. Three, there is not one mall cop here as far as I can tell. I don't know, I mean, hmm. Boo, this is an experience. Have it. I'll run interference. Okay, but I'm blaming you and driving away if I get caught. Perfect. This is a bad fucking idea. What do you mean? I'm gonna distract the clerk, I can do this. Okay, I will admit that drawing attention is the talent you have. I'm great at crimes. But what if I get caught? You won't. I'll just start screaming if I have to. How's that a good idea? Let's go. Okay, but if this goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Join the club. Hey! 
Uh huh. I've got a question. T-shirts at 20% off. Yeah, I saw. I was wondering about something else. Okay. The name of this store. Yeah. Haha, <laughs> you probably get this question a lot. Try me. So, what time do you get off later? You know, no one ever asks this, but I think about it all the time. New revolution? I bet. God. You know what the official business name on our checks is? New revolution radical UTH culture uprising inc. That's really dumb. Oh god, I know. Like guys, can't we just be a store that sells cool shit to teens? Yeah, teens go nut for this shit. The employee discount is also pretty great. I had a job once. Had a 100% discount. Uh-huh. When I stole shit. No, I got what you meant the first time. I bet you grab things all the time. Well, they're big into prosecuting to the full of the law here, so... Okay, I'm done looking. Let's go. Okay, it was nice talking to you. Bye now. Uh, see ya. Why did I do that? You did so well, Boo. I call the cops on shoplif shoplifters at my own store. This? <laughs> What'd you get? <laughs> Some kind of necklace thing? Nice, nice. Oh god. Forget it, we're home free. Really? Yeah, we're like... <laughs> out in open waters now. I feel kind of sick. Let's walk it off. Oh, I completely forgot about this giant fish head. Oh my god, I loved her. Did you ever come to the summer days thing here? Yeah, I'd like to squirt people. I still have no idea how they did that. I always assumed it was some guy in there with a squirt gun. One time I saw it knock a guy down. Yeah, every year that would happen and someone would make a fuss. But like, I don't know. You showed up to be squirted by a fish fountain. Hehe, <laughs> you know the walkway up there? Past the upper food court thing. Up in the atrium. The what? The ceiling, the glass part that points up. I know what an atrium is. Yeah? When I was a kid, I thought that's where God lived. Wow. I don't know, I just remember staring at it when I was a kid, like eating a burger and trying to see if I could see God, like, peeking over or something. <laughs> Looks like they've got some weird hanging art up there now. Wanna go up and see? Nah, my knees are killing me from work. You up for eating? Uh, uh, it's kinda hungry when we got here. Um, I want to see the rest of them all, sorry. Mm. You know what, let's go ahead and eat. Maybe we'll see the rest of them all in a minute. Maybe not though, I don't know. I- shit, I don't know. I don't want to miss more, like, dialogue points with her, though. Vibes music. Well, this should be good. I wonder what kind of- Oh, come on. There's no one working the counter? Oh, wow. Hello, anyone here? Jeez. This is bleak. This is like something out of a failed state or something. What's that? When you make a country and it doesn't work out. So, like this country? Ayy. <laughs> Ayy. Jeez. Ruins. Let's see what they've got here. Honky Tonk Armageddon. Rolling on the of the Reeves remix. Honky Tonk. I'd actually listen to that, just to see what the hell it even means. Cover's got a pickup truck exactly like my uncle's. 
But this one is on fire and flying at a dragon's face. Upgrade. Oh, hey. It's that band. What band? You know. You remember this song. Had that video that people posted like a zillion times. I have literally no idea what you're talking about. It had that weird horse in it. Oh, yeah, I remember. It had a weird horse in it. Oh, God, yeah, that was... That horse was all. I remember. Yep, we have officially remembered that video. We did it! Okay, well, let's... <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Is there more mall to see, or do we just need to go back and have something to eat? Yeah, let's go back and have something to eat. Because that's all there is. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. We can walk but very slowly. Yes. Let's eat. Okay. I expected more excitement. Mall food court dinner. <laughs> oh, what a feeling. See, that wasn't hard. <laughs> what did you get? You inhaled it before I got a look. Go for... Burger. Burger. It's just a big pile of crabs and meat, huh? Isn't that what we are? Bones, too. I don't want bones in my burger. <laughs> Rain. What? Remember when Kathy Damonco pulled out Cindy Clark's nose ring here? You know what that was about, right? Wasn't Kathy pregnant with... What was his name? Football guy? Ron Boonstar. I didn't know you knew about that. Well, I mean, there was the first football game of our senior year, and Ron ran up to the sidelines and yelled at the stands. My first touchdowns from my beautiful firstborn and his mommy, Kathy Daminico. That's something. Kathy was in marching band, and she was crying, I think. And I think he dumped her for Cindy a week later. Oh yeah, see, that's the part I know about. That's what set off the whole nose ring situation. I wonder what Kathy's up to now. Uh, I wonder what happened to Cindy. No, I wonder what happened to fucking Kathy. Well, last year Ron had his ATV accident, and somehow Kathy and him got to talking after that, and they got married. What? Yeah, Ron's parents set them up set them out, up out on a double wide uh, in Brittle since Kathy refused to end up in Possum Springs. Brittle's like 15 minutes away. You know what the worst part of this story is? Sort of high school drama. Ron. At the time I was like, God moves things around in the strangest ways to bring two people together. Huh, I guess. Well, they used to make things make at least sense. Thinking about this place, the fountain, and the god walkway and stuff. Not knowing how something worked used to seem like magic. Now not knowing means it might be going wrong and I may not be able to fix it. Helped knowing someone was uh, at the controls, you know. Now I'm just tired all the time from the shop. When I was at school, yeah. Uh, don't even want to talk about it. What happened anyway? Something happened. You wanna run around the mall some more? Uh, there's not really much else to run around. We can check out the weird, bad art upstairs. I wanna touch it. Please don't. I wanna run. You run, I'm gonna sit here. I'm tired and sad now. Sh suit yourself. No! Can we touch the weird art?
Can we jump on the weird art? <gasps> we can jump on the weird art. How do I get back on the weird art? Okay. Oh wow. Is this? <laughs> Fantastic. Whoa, hey. What is happening? <laughs> this is the greatest. <laughs> <laughs> How do I? Oh, I can control it. I don't understand how I'm doing this, but it's wonderful. <laughs> Beatrice Santillo. <laughs> don't give them our names. Beatrice Jones! Oh wow, is that you, God? Yes it is I, God Stevenson. I didn't know you had a last name, Silence Mortal. Through my fish monster, I have lain waste to your kind. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty magical. Silence, I shan't, I shan't say it again. You and your good and noble companion shall get ice cream on the way home. Ha ha ha, we should probably get out of here. <laughs> Before you're arrested. <laughs> the cops shall be confused and stuff and beat each other up. For I am God and I hate the cops. Okay, okay, get down here. Have a good one, mortal. <laughs> because it's not sticking it to the man the man isn't going to lose anything here but she will get in a lot of trouble she's just a cog in a much bigger machine hmm? sure whatever's returned the shit okay okay I'm going hi hello you're back yeah we stole some shit here is that shit we don't want you to get in trouble with your boss it's not your fault the world is like it is. What, you stole this? You're just a cog in a much bigger machine. To blame you would be like blaming a thing inside a whole thing. So you're returning stolen merchandise. One day folks like you are going to overthrow the whole thing. What whole thing? The whole thing. We're leaving. Stay strong, you beautiful dreamer. You have nothing to lose but your chains. What? <laughs> Oh lord, okay. Alright, this place used to be something. I mean, it's still something. 
Nah, just a big, mostly empty thing. It's a big, mostly empty parking lot. Well, you work with what you have. Let's never come here again. Don't have to convince me. I only came here because you wanted to. Well, Fort Lucin used to be something. Now Fort Lucin's over. Let's go. Let it die in peace. Let it die. I want to drive on, on the way home. Nope. <laughs> no, we're not allowed to drive our car. <laughs> okay, can I finish this please? Sup, Dad? Heard you had a wild time last night. I didn't drink. It works better if you let me accuse you first. Right. Here's my hangover cure. Not drinking the night before. Wow, hold on, let me write that down. It's complicated, I know. What did you do tonight? Went out with Boo. You have a good time? Yeah, she's kinda, I don't know. Like she's older, like much older. And kinda sad. Well, she's been through a lot. Yeah. Hey dad, would you mind moving the boxes in the crawl space? Well, what have you done for me lately? Been an excellent daughter. Been a credit to this family. <laughs> that doesn't count. Well, would you watch some TV with me? Yeah, for a little bit. Sure. Hop up, I'm watching Garbo and Mallory. Nice. Disaster around the corner. <laughs> Every mirror I own, I'm lucky enough to never have. So look at this mug. <laughs> the rest of us. What? That's a whoopa. Uh, can we get away from this? Garbo and I join a cult. Okay, we're gonna run away now. Okay, thanks. Bye. As long as you move the boxes, I don't really care. Yes. Hey, cool mall times. Pretty cool mall times, yes. Hope we didn't make too much of a mess with the fountain. Who's we? I was merely sitting there when I was assaulted with mall water. I will not rest until that fountain is brought to justice. Tell the world my story. They must know. I'm going to sleep. I hope the nightmares aren't too horrible. It is a trauma I shall bear forever. Hey dude, what did you do tonight? Nothing much. Stole something for Angus. It's a surprise. Wow, what is it? Hold on for a sec. Oh crap, I gotta go talk to you later. Okay, weirdo, you too. Okay? Alright, well. Let's end the day, shall we? An eventful day it has been. Bedtime? Why is no the first option? Yes. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. I'm gonna cut this part off here. Uh, at least I, I really want to cut this part off here. Oh, what the, the frick frack. Okay, I, I need to go though. So, thanks for coming along on this journey with me. And I will see you in the next part. Sorry this one got a little long. But thanks again, and see you next time. Bye. <laughs>